This is your severe weather outlook for Friday, September 6, 2019, produced and brought to you by Extreme Weather. I am Extreme Weather's AI assistant meteorologist, James Johnson. Our outlook uses information derived from the National Weather Service Weather Prediction Center, located in Norman, Oklahoma. Here is your severe weather outlook summary. Strong thunderstorms may impact parts of the northern Intermountain region, northern Rockies and Front Range this afternoon and evening, and pose at least some risk for severe hail and wind. Hurricane Dorian bringing strong winds, storm surge and tornadoes from the southeast to the mid-Atlantic. And now here is your detailed outlook for today. Hurricane Dorian appears in the process of accelerating northeastward near the North Carolina coast. This is forecast to continue across and offshore of the mid-Atlantic coast by midday, as at least a couple of significant short-wave troughs dig within moderately strong northwest flow across the Canadian prairies through the lower Great Lakes and northeast. Models suggest that the lead impulse may begin to interact with Dorian by tonight south-southeast of the southern New England coast, but the strongest low-level cyclonic wind field is expected to pass to the south and east of Cape Cod by 12 Z Saturday. Upstream amplified mid-level troughing over the eastern Pacific is forecast to remain progressive and approach the Pacific coast during this period. As it does, a weaker preceding short wave trough appears likely to progress inland of the northern California and Oregon coast. Models suggest that it will gradually broaden and turn eastward, then southeastward across the northern Intermountain region and Rockies. As it does, it likely will suppress a prominent mid-level high now centered near the Colorado Rockies, and lee surface troughing will gradually develop across the northern into central high plains. Northern Intermountain Region Rockies Front Range. A belt of moderately strong mid-level flow, including 30 to 40 plus kT at 500 MB, accompanying the short wave trough, will contribute to at least modest shear across the region today. Coupled with the development of weak to moderate boundary layer cape, in the presence of steep lower mid-tropospheric lapse rates, the environment may become at least marginally conducive to widely scattered strong storms, which could pose a risk for severe hail and wind. This could include isolated supercells. Strongest destabilization, including cape on the order of 1000 J kg, is expected to become focused within lee surface troughing, near just east of the front range late this afternoon as well as beneath stronger cooling associated with the mid-level cold core across parts of eastern Oregon into central and southern Idaho by early this afternoon. Special Outlook Note. Southern Mid-Atlantic Coast. The low-level circulation center of Hurricane Dorian is forecast to reach the Outer Banks area of North Carolina by 12 Z this morning, with tropical boundary layer instability, supportive of any appreciable lingering risk for tornadoes waterspouts, likely east of the southeast Virginia northeast North Carolina coastal waters around the beginning of the period, if not before. This broadcast is made possible in part by Extreme Weather. Funding for this broadcast is provided in part by our viewers and their donations. We would like to thank our viewers for their continued support of this Extreme Weather program. Thank you for listening and please check back often for further weather updates that may impact you and your area.